Jim. <laughs> you play. You You're play. pretty quiet over there, sir. Yeah. <laughs> um. You are a basically a very big fan favorite. People just love you. And he's the butler in it. You preside over the downstairs staff. Now, one of the new characters in the movie, I was happy to see her. I just am a big fan of your wife, Imelda Staunton, mm. who now appears in the movie and actually is married to Carson. How do you like that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh. So, but she, Imelda plays a, a, an upstairs lady. Yeah. She's the higher rank, and you're, you know, you're the lowly downstairs I was guy. furious, yeah. I was yeah. Really, yeah, how did that work out with her? Well, well I was sitting at home, and she came into the kitchen. Uh, I can paint this little domestic scene, if I may. Um, <laughs> and, and she said, I've just been offered a part in a film. Oh, yeah, what's that? She said, it's Downton Abbey. And I'd read the script, and I thought, Mrs Patmore doesn't have a new assistant. What, yeah. what part would she play? <laughs> well, I found she was an aristocrat upstairs, and yeah. the Queen's lady in waiting. I was furious. <laughs> and I thought... <laughs> And I thought, I hope she doesn't expect me to wait on her at home. <laughs> um, although, thinking about it, I do pour the wine do you? quite often at home. <laughs> uh, so, but it was, the, the, unfortunately, we, I mean, we, we met on stage in, in Guys and Dolls, the musical. Mm -hmm. How That's many six, years ago? Th we've been married 35 wow. years. Good so, That's a round of applause for stamina, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that very much. And they always much. say marry up, so you, you did well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> Hugh, people, not, they recognize the show and they recognize you guys here in the U.S. And, and in the U.K., but all over the world, India, Indonesia. What is it about this show and the nostalgia that we have for this period in history? Do we wish we lived back then? I, I, well, I think if we wished it, it's, uh, you know, be careful what you wish for, yeah. because let's face it, times were hard, a lot harder than for 99% of the population. We, you know, we're looking at a, a tiny proportion who, who live in the upstairs uh, bit of this house. I think I can only put it down to, as a, well, one of our uh, <coughs> interviewers the other day, you know, we, we turned it back on them. What, what do you think? What do you like about this show? And he said, well, it's simple. It's about family. Um, and it's uh, that family, you know, both up and downstairs. The house is the, uh, is, is the principal character in which this big family uh, exists and uh, all the interplay between those characters. Michelle, the real-life royal family has admitted that they are fans of the show. Yes, apparently. I'm happy to hear that. And Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, once visited the set she did, weeks before it? giving birth to Princess Charlotte. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. It was such that was she an incredible the film. day. Yeah, she was there for, uh, for hours, wasn't she? And she met every single person um, yeah. involved in Downton, and it was a really, really special day. And um, Joanne Frogot and I, who plays Anna, we uh, rehearsed the scene, and she came in and watched. And we were so nervous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> performing she for the princess. Nice. Um, she's she's yeah. so lovely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was wonderful. Well, yeah. speaking of royalty, Jim, you had quite the honor. He right? Did. Recently, it's... earlier this year, when Prince Charles awarded you what's called the OBE, or Order of the British Empire for Services mm -hmm. to Drop. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It's a huge deal. Um, yeah. What did that mean to you? I was very honoured and delighted. I was pleased that um, my mum, who had just turned 100, was alive to see me oh. get that. So that was great. Um, and there's... There's actually, uh, I think we've got a photograph of here of Prince Charles pinning the, the, the honour on, on my chest. And he said to me, I gather you, you've made a film, and, and I couldn't think what to say, so I said, yes, and your staff treated us abominably. <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and then I said, oh, but that's a spoiler, don't tell anyone. And he told me, I think there's another picture of him laughing like a drain, so I'm yeah. pleased about that. <laughs> oh, they have so much fun at the royal castle. Mm -hmm. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Laura, you and your co-stars look absolutely beautiful on the cover of Town & Country. Oh. Magazine. Look at you. Thank you. <laughs> it's become a phenomenon, the whole thing. Was it fun? Have you, has your life changed? Oh my God, so much. Yeah, I, it's really changed all of our lives. Is this the end of it, do you think? I don't know. We keep <laughs> being asked if there's a sequel. Would you go and watch so. another film? Yeah! Honestly, yeah. so please do it. <laughs> you got married. And Alan, yeah. you have a happy ending in your own life. Yes, yes. Because yeah. you recently got married, Jessica Blair Herman, of course, yeah. from mm -hmm. American Crime Story. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you guys just announced that you're expecting your first baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah we are indeed. Very exciting.
Very excited, yeah. How, how is she feeling? How is everyone doing? She's feeling wonderful, and obviously, as you can see, she looks incredible. It was yeah. such a joy to have her uh, in London for the premiere. Um, yes, yeah, she's, and she's handling it brilliantly. Are you ready to be dead? I can't wait. Congratulations. Uh, yeah. Thank you, you very much. Thank Congratulations. You. We love you all. <laughs> we do. We love you. Make another movie. Yeah. Our thanks to the cast. Downton Abbey is in theaters tomorrow.